Hello fellow couch potatoes, welcome to today's video. It was a rare elimination for Bachelor Nation as the Bachelor star Matt James was eliminated in this week's elimination on Dancing with the Stars. It was a close call though, the judges had to choose between Matt James and another reality star, Kenya Moore. Did you agree with their choice? I didn't. I believe there's still more of untapped potential in Matt James, but what do I know? I know who knows more than me, and that is Autumn. Here is his point of view of the Disney Week elimination. Morning, everyone. Well, this morning for me, I woke up, I called my parents because I haven't talked to them for a while. I called Nicole, I spoke to my little Tay Tay because I miss him so, so much. Speaking of missing him so, so much. I never really knew as a parent um, how you miss your kids because I never really traveled away from them for so long and they said they're going to be with actually five. So it's been a really long time and I, yeah, I'm struggling. I'm getting to the point where I'm starting to struggle a lot, uh, not seeing Nicole and Tay Tay. Um, so yeah, just want to share that with you. I don't know why, but I do. But speaking of elimination, Oh my God, what happened? I cannot believe it. Not that I ever want anyone to go home because this is the type of a show that, sorry, got cut off. Um, and you just, you just don't want anyone to live. Why can't we just make a show that no one goes home and everybody dances every single style, every single dance, and then at the end you just announce a winner. And it's probably not gonna be the most entertaining show in the world, but at least it would not feel like it feels on um, on Monday, Tuesday night, at least last week. Um, it feels so bad for both couples, you know, Brian and Shana. I feel like Brian was really putting his all into it, diving in and trying to do absolutely his best. And it's hard for people who've never had any experience to dance, you know, or... Uh, or not natural, have a natural ability to do that. You know, I feel like it's, it's, it, it could be really extremely, extremely hard. And I feel like they definitely had that. Um, and I'm just so happy for them. I mean, they make a beautiful couple and just the energy between them too. It just, it's so nice to see people happy. It's, it really is awesome. And um, getting to know Brian this season, cause I haven't really like, knew him before i've heard of him and trying to talk to him about it a lot but like meeting brian is actually he's a really awesome guy i really really enjoy his company and the energy and what he has to bring to you know their relationship and how he is it's really really cool um lindsay and matt oh my god i'm so sad uh, i feel really bad for matt because matt was just giving it his when i say everything like, I'm sure when you saw his pass to double, I mean, he was attacking every single dance and he literally wasn't wasting one second to do anything. So, and he enjoyed that. It's so hard to see someone like that go because I feel like Dancing with the Stars is the show for people kind of like Matt, you know, we can, when they coming into something they not familiar with, they loving they like every single day they try their hardest and you can just see what it meant to him um and after he got eliminated like he i just we obviously tried to like you know give them hug even though we can't because of the you know all the rules in the world uh with COVID. but it's just like i don't know just want like squeeze him and be like Hey, dude, you did amazing, and he really did. And Lindsay, you did such an amazing job with with Matt. I mean, you guys look great. Um, every single dance he delivered. And all right, sorry for this morning rumble. I knew before I said I'm going to be doing it after every show, and I really had a really good intent to do so and <laughs> attempting that. But then days just start and. I'm trying to be better at this, but I'm really clearly not. Um, I'm doing this because I have a few seconds, minutes that I just 
want to take to myself and when that happens i can actually do this so um again just want to say thank you guys our week was very special for melora and myself we got ridiculous scores and melora did such an amazing job performing it on monday and tuesday and i felt like she was living in those characters and that's what she does and it, it was really like amazing to see that come alive and her singing uh, was absolutely mind blowing for the modern. We're just super thrilled to be in a competition, uh, go to training, and you know try to do another great dance for you guys to uh, for you to see and enjoy and be entertained by it. So um, it's an exciting week. It's a Greece week, which is every single couple going to be doing a song from Greece in that order of the beginning of the movie to to the end. So it's almost like going to be uh, watching a movie, but uh, with us dancing and, well, kind of acting, I guess. Um, so it's going to be really exciting. We've never done this before. I'm super excited for our dance and um, our scene. Um, Melora is excited too. And um, yeah, we just want to make sure. I just want to make sure that I'm doing a good job putting it together. So that Hey, couch potato. Thank you for watching. Click like and subscribe. See you on the next video. Bye.